And coming up next, our main event, a matchup for the UFC middleweight division title. champion of the world, here he is, the number one middleweight contender for a long time. This man has been one of the best 85ers in the world, but this title fight eluded him. It is here right now, he is healthy, he is smack dab in the middle of his prime, and he believes he is the best 85er in the world and is out to prove just that tonight. He walk away with 12 pounds of UFC gold. So here's the undisputed UFC middleweight champion of the world making the walk, looking to defend his title. It is certainly something that he's been able to do in the past. He has been challenged on this title run. It's not as though he has run roughshod through this division, but they're all still chasing him at 185 pounds tonight. At least on paper, could be his most difficult challenge today. tail of the tape for this middleweight championship fight. Four years, the difference in age between these two fighters, and they both possess the same height and a similar reach. Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC middleweight championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 23 wins, two losses. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Presenting the challenger, Israel, the last style bender, Adesanya. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the Corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of seven wins, one loss. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 184 pounds. Fighting out of Sao Paulo, Brazil. Ladies and gentlemen, the reigning, defending UFC middleweight champion, Alex Poetan. UFC belt on the line, guys. Protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. They touch him up and we are underway. advantage on paper when you're a striker at this guy's level that will normally balance out whatever advantage the other guy has nice punch lands well perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there nice kick landed by this gentleman oh man this guy kicks like a mule 
kicked so hard. He kicked so hard every time you can see him drive his shin into his opponent. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body. Lock him, shock him out of the shoot here. Oh! Big ball to punch land. Now he gets back to range. Oh, man. How many head kicks can one man absorb before getting separated from his conscience? One, normally. <laughs> this guy has a great chin, but if he takes any more, he's going to be sleeping. Is that a big knee to the body? We'll see if he can follow up. Massive head kick. Oh! Oh, what a punch. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. Adesanya going for the body kick there, but he misses. No setup whatsoever there. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Oh! Huge kick to the head. Oh, nice jab. Able to check the high kick. And he landed the right hand there. I'm not sure his opponent knows where he is. No, he doesn't know where he is. He's hurt real bad. That punch landed in the perfect spot. So just over 20 total strikes have now landed for the last style bender, Israel Adesanya. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? Oh, beautiful strike there by Israel Adesanya. He's got a lifetime in the game, not a lifetime in the UFC, but you see, this is a lifelong striker who is very dangerous with all legs. Yeah, and when you're standing with Izzy, you're in trouble, man. You're under constant attack the whole time because you never know what he's going to hit you with. And right there, he lands the strike that he was looking for. Round two straight ahead. All right, let's now look back at some of the action from that round. He went head hunting, landed, nearly got the finish too. A lot of coaches tell you don't head hunt. In this case, he's been head hunting and he landed a big enough shot to truly put his opponent on notice. It is blocked by Adesanya. Well, missed on that one. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Adesanya's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. What a punch. Oh! Oh! Right thus far. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. Oh! That one was thrown to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> Head kick attempt, it's blocked. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, <laughs> if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off uh -huh. with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let's oh, try have the sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. That one was thrown to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> Real nice body. Oh, and now his opponent in a world of 
control. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was too high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after. Oh. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Back to the feet. Trying to establish that jab. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh! Now he's on top of him looking for the finish. Oh, he got it back! Wow! Wow! Oh! And there comes the stoppage! He's done! He's done! What a performance! Beautiful shot to end the fight right there. It couldn't have landed much more flush than it did, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, quite frankly. So, near-perfect execution on the strike that ultimately results in the KO here. Oh, right, we'll take a look back at the highlights. You know we're gonna find that nasty head kick somewhere in this highlight rip. Just an incredible result for him here tonight. A very nice head kick to finish the fight, but don't ignore all the work he did with his hands and give credit to the opponent. The opponent was in there every step of the way. And in order to get a fight of the night like you got tonight, both guys have to be willing to participate. The official decision is in. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 24 seconds of round number two. To play the winner by knockout and still. King of the 185 pounders, there he is, the undisputed UFC middleweight champion after the knockout tonight in his title defense. And that's gotta feel pretty good. There were a lot of people backing the number one contender coming in here tonight, but he 